Hi, I'm William Haynes. This episode was brought to you by Domain.com. And before we get started, I'd just like to show you a magic trick. Just kidding, I don't know how to do that shit. I'm William Haynes. This is a show. People be like, go. This show is basically where I get to talk smack about people in the news because I will never meet them in real life. First off, I'd like to talk about a man named Tyshawn Granger who reportedly was fired from his job at McDonald's for putting his mixtape in children's Happy Meals. Dude, I respect the hustle, but that's not the right demographic. Kids don't want to hear mixtapes. They want to hear the annoying stuff on the radio. Also, the title of his album was Tales of a Real N-Word. What kind of tracks are on this tape? You work at McDonald's. What kind of tales can you tell? I'm a Big Mac dude with Big Mac issues. Let me tell you, homie, something. It's you, buy my nuggets, man. Buy my nuggets, man. Buy my nuggets, man. I'm so sorry, dude, for making fun of you. Please don't come shoot me. I'm trying to win an EGOT someday. That's an Emmy, a Grammy, an Oscar, and a Tony. I can't do that with multiple bullet wounds in my head. Plus, you'll get arrested. Write a song about me from prison. Actually, the cops ain't gonna catch you if you shoot me. They'll be like, ugh, finally someone got that idiot. Also, cops caught a man in Toronto for attempting to drive in the carpool lane by using mannequins to trick traffic police. Of course, it got caught by the cops because most cops aren't idiots, unless you put a camera on them. And I don't blame this guy's logic. I love mannequins. Some mannequins are hotter than some people. Damn, damn. Damn, damn! So I don't blame him for wanting a bad side piece next to him on the ride. A trend going on on the internet this week is the hashtag no makeup selfie. Isabella Gaines is a teenage pageant queen from Wilmington, North Carolina, when last week someone posted this photo on the internet of her with the caption, this is the same person in both pics. Amazing what makeup can do. You asshole! I know you meant that as a compliment, but that's mean. But Gaines decided to not be offended and uploaded several photos of herself without makeup, which started a trend. Other people joined in on the hashtag no makeup selfie in order to combat cyberbullying. This is just proof that all we do today is judge each other. You look better like this. You look better like that. You know what it is that you look the best? Whenever you feel the best. Stop letting other people tell you how to look and how to feel. Buy some 12 inch rims and stun on them. Rant over. Finally, I can't ignore this anymore. I've seen so many articles on the internet promoting this new app called Who Deleted Me that tells you who deleted you on Facebook. The people who really want to know who deleted them on Facebook are the same people who are sitting on Facebook not doing shit all day long. And that's why they care about this. I don't know how to express my discontent for this in any other way than a poetry slam. Facebook, the friend book. If you delete me, my friends might look. Poke me and I feel sad, like my status, please. Unless you're my dad, he likes all of them. Seriously, don't delete me. Booyaboo! I got the app, I will know, I will kill you, I am violent. Shaza! Where's the boat, hop on it! That went differently. So what do you guys think about all of this? What would you do if you found out someone deleted you on Facebook? Probably nothing. Do you think we judge each other too much on our appearances on social media? Let me know in the comments down below. Stay tuned for your final week. And thanks again to the sponsor of this episode, Domain.com. You know Domain, the place to go when you got a cool idea and you need to make a site. It is a one-stop shop for all your web host needs. And you don't have to just use .com or .net anymore. They have over 200 domain extensions for you to use, like .expert or .nyc if you want to live somewhere cool. Save 15% on domain names when you use the code people at domain.com. So check out, you hear that mom? I got my own sponsor, we made it. When do I get to play an animal in a DreamWorks movie? I wanna be a donkey or a zebra. Also, if you wanna see something on the show next week, go ahead and send me a link over at Mr. William Haynes on Twitter. And if you're still bored on the internet, I have a personal channel where I make videos like this one. In layman's terms, let's say this box represents the children of today's innocence, and this PVC pipe represents the media. This is what it's done to us and our self-esteem. Subscribe if you want to, thank you. I can't do it. We'll do it live. No. We'll do it live! Fuck it! I can, I'll write it and we'll do it live!